Next, I'm going to show you the chorus, <clears throat> which begins in A minor. And now you're using your thumb to play five, three, four, three, all the way through this. It's the same picking all the way through this um, chorus, so once you learn it, it should be easy just moving your left hand fingers then. And uh, keeping this uh, picky part the same. So your thumb now plays. Okay, and now the other fingers play. If you play five, three and one, then four, four, two, three, one. So it's five, three and one, four, three, two, one, four, two, three, one. Keeping this picking bit the same, we lift our two fingers off, leave our index finger on the second, first fret of the second string, and move a finger to the second fret on the fifth string, and do the same picking again. And then move up to a C chord, same picking again. Back down to the last chord. So the whole of the chorus sounds like this. Sorry, it doesn't. It sounds like this. Okay. <clears throat> so the next part is the middle part, which is in between the verse and the chorus. Back to your G. It starts off the same. Okay, instead of going to your fourth fret with your little finger on the third string, you hammer on to the third, um, second fret on your third string when you should be playing that note. So it's. And then. 4 2. together and hammer up to your fourth fret on your third string and then four two six three four two again okay so far and then you lift the, everything off the third string play it open <clears throat> and you Fret your second fret on the fourth string and you play six, three, four, two, and then play the same plucking again, moving your uh, little finger up to the fourth fret on the fourth string. So you play, okay, the whole of the middle bit. Off the middle bit, sorry, and then again. The second time, you, you put, play a, a pull off on the third string, second fret. fourth fret on the uh, <clears throat> fourth string and you play six three four two six three four two 
And uh, index finger on the second fret on the fourth string. Six three four two. Six three four two again. So we have. Okay, from halfway through this part. So the whole of the middle part, or interlude, whatever bit you want to call it, sounds like this. And then back into your verse. Um, so that's pretty much the whole song, other than the ending. Um, so your intro is the same as the verse, and then verse, chorus, uh, middle bit, verse, chorus, middle bit, verse, chorus, middle bit, I think it's four times. And then the very last part. So I have to remind myself because it's um, still fresh in my mind. off you play the same as the verse which we've got down and then this time little finger on the third fret on the first string first and sixth and then you pull off the little finger so you pull off and then strings four and two and then six lift your finger off uh, play it open two Back onto this third fret on the second string, and then one and uh, sorry, two and six, and pull off the second string, and then so it's pull off three, four, and three, six, and one. should have okay then the last part of this ending you move your little finger to the fourth fret on the fourth string and you play six two three sorry six two four three lift your little finger off Index finger on the second fret on the third string, um, and then it's four, two. Oh, so. Yeah, that's right. So with this finger here, uh, it's four, two. stuck here but it's difficult to remember okay and then and then finger on the third fret on the fifth string and you play in five and three five then three to the second fret, five, then three. Open uh, fat fifth. Back up to the second fret on the fifth. So you have. And then finger on 
your G shape on the sixth string, and then you just strum your top three strings. So you've got. Okay, this is tricky. This bit. Let's see if I can play the last half of it. Okay, so. Hopefully it will sound like this. 